This is a review of a Zaccurate finger pulse oxygen sensor. I bought from Amazon for £36. Obviously the price has been inflated because of COVID-19. It probably cost £20 before the pandemic. Anyway, I chose this one because it's been on the market for four years on Amazon. So I ignored all the cheap ones that have just appeared with no feedback. Well, this has got about 400 in terms of feedback. So it should be reliable. Anyway, it cost £36 in mid-April. And we'll see what we got. Another reason I got it because it's actually been delivered. Others were you have to wait for it to be shipped from China. So you're not going to get it until mid-May. First impressions are it looks good, it's got some kind of plastic covering on it, which I wasn't expecting. Batteries, it comes with batteries, that's another good sign. Another good sign that you're getting quality. A lanyard, neck to put it, to cut, uh, to hold it with. Some plastic covering. That's where you put your finger. First impressions are well, seems okay. So let's put the battery in and see what it's like, how accurate it is. It's one of those necessary little medical tools you need in times such as this. The instruction booklet's in English and the text isn't so small that you can't read. It's another good sign. So it is worth paying more and getting something with some feedback. Like I said, this, I chose this one even though it cost twice as much as the others because it's got a lot of feedback and it's been on the market for four years. With others, virtually of about a hundred others that suddenly appeared, there's zero feedback, only two or three. And even them, they seem dubious. So I'd rather pay £36 for something that works than £18 for something that doesn't. Let's pop the battery in and see what reading we get at the time of COVID-19. Help to monitor your oxygen. It should be, from what research I've done, oxygen levels should be around 100%, 98%, somewhere like that. So that's what I'm expecting. Okay, so that's the battery in. Let's use it for the first time. So, finger in, switch it on and let's see what happens let's keep it stationary oh, 93, 94 it's a bit low isn't it, let's see what happens when I hold my breath Giving a reading of 95, it's flashing on air because of the frequency, but the display is steady. 96 now. Let's hold my breath again and see what happens. holding my breath doesn't make any difference did around 94 let's try and breathe no not making any difference is it working 94 is a bit low isn't it because I'm outdoors, I use my forefinger to 
try a different finger see if I get a different reading okay now let's see 94 again not good is it it's that bottom one heart rate so it looks like I got 94 reading my pulse is 96, it's a bit high. It should be 100. 98, it's a bit low, isn't it? I'll try it with someone else, see what happens. Put your finger in. Put it in, all the way in. All the way in. Yeah. Let's see what your sensor is. Don't move. 98. Pulse rate. Yours is normal. Mine was 94. Yeah? Mm. Yours is normal. Pulse rate is small. So mine is low. And put it in, open it. Hold it like that. Yeah, I'm opening it. Mm. Let's see how well, it might be outdoors, indoors might be different. So with 94. So 95. So I've got a high pulse. And 95 against so it was 50 and 98. Come on, Annie, let's test. Uh, yes. How old are you? 13. 12. 12. Right, put your finger in right to the end. <laughs> just put it in. <laughs> what are you doing? It's just test the oxygen. Now put it down on the thing. Let me turn it on. You might not read it, children's, but we'll see. Yours should be 100. Your mum's was 98 normal. Mine was low. 99. 99, yeah, that's it. That's what it should be. Your pulse rate. Why is your heart beating so fast? Oh, it's coming down. Is that 88? Oh, you were worried. Look, you can see even when you were panicking. This can make a good lie detector. I could put it in and I could tell if you're lying because your heart rate goes up. <laughs> eh? It could be like a lie detector. Are you lying to me? No. <laughs> yeah, 99, yours is healthy. What's mine? Where is it? I'm dead. I'm, oh, there we go. 95. 41 pulse. My pulse is. Higher than that. Oh, it's not really. Yeah. It, it is accurate of sorts, but you need to measure it several times. It's fussy. It's a bit fussy when it works. Oh there, 100, 100%. Give me some of your oxygen. Yeah. She's using up all the oxygen. This is 100% reading. She's too healthy.